Hello everyone and we are back with another special admission notification and this time it is by IIT Hyderabad the Department of Biotechnology is inviting applications for PhD admissions for the year 2022. Let's quickly take a look at what the eligibility criteria for the same is. The Indian Institute of Technology Hyderabad Department of Biotechnology is calling for applications for PhD admissions for the year 2022. This Department of Biotechnology was established in 2010 and it offers outstanding research programs in the frontier areas of biotechnology encompassing both applied and basic research. Some examples like NMR spectroscopy, X-ray crystallography, computational biology, cell signaling, calcium signaling in cancer, protein misfolding diseases, infectious diseases, HIV biology, cancer biology, RNA biology, genomics, etc. Research activities in the department are funded by the national agencies such as DBT, DST, ICMR, CSIR, etc. The mission of the PhD program is to develop a new generation of scientific leaders with scientific vigor, critical thinking, ethics, and multitasking managerial skills to thrive in the fast-paced, technology-driven industry and academia. So what are the research areas? Qualified and motivated candidates are requested to apply for admission to the PhD program in the following research areas. The first one being lipid DNA interaction, DNA nanotechnology, membrane spanning DNA nanostructure, artificial water channels, membrane fusion, computational modeling of the virion entry into the host cells, biological nanopores. The second one being molecular mechanisms of diseases, multiomics approaches, biomolecular interaction prediction, microsatellite repeat expansion disorders, antimicrobial resistance, biomolecular NMR, molecular dynamics simulation. So what are the minimum eligibility criteria? Candidates with valid CSIR net GRF, UGC net GRF, DBT GRF category one award or any other equivalent national level qualification for research fellowship that is DST inspire fellowship. More on the eligibility, MTech in any allied areas of life sciences plus a valid national level GRF qualification or MSc in any allied areas of life sciences plus a valid national level GRF qualifications. You can also see a BTEC, a BE that is a four years in any allied areas of life sciences plus a valid national level GRF qualification will also work. Now the minimum marks are for general category at least 63% marks in the highest qualifying degree and reservation as per rules here. Now candidates with experience, interest in computational biology, data mining, machine learning, deep learning and molecular modeling will be given preference. So ensure that the minimum eligibility criteria are met before applying and hostel facilities may not be available immediately to the admitted candidates but may be available eventually. So what is the selection procedure? Candidates will be shortlisted according to the criteria set by a shortlisting committee. Only shortlisted candidates will be called for an interview. Selection to this PhD program will be based on the performance in the interview. So make a note, your performance in the interview is also very important. Request to change the interview date or time will not be entertained. So how do you apply for this? First off, there is the notification which is available on this page. This page will be linked in the description box. So if you click on this notification, you can read more details, in-depth details if you want. And also the link to apply online will be provided on that page and this page as well. So you need to first make the payment and then send in your complete CV and all of the other certificates, details required to an email ID, all of which is provided on this Biotechnica webpage. Again, the link is in the description. Now, if you re recall, I stressed on the interview part where I said the performance in an interview is important. So this is the perfect segue to the JAP program that Biotechnica has. I hope most of you all know about this. It's the job assistance program with placement assistance and interview guarantee. So in this program, we'll be teaching you how to do your research proposal writing, resume drafting, networking, mock interviews, personal interviews, and even soft skills. So these are all important skills that you require while attempting or attending an interview. So this you can learn if you enroll for our JAP program. The link for which will be given in the description box. This program starts soon and there's a coupon code called JAP20 for all of you viewers watching this video. So make sure you are subscribed to our YouTube channel, follow us on all of our social media, especially Telegram because that is where all of the latest updates get posted first. Leave a like on this video and comment down below what more you would like to hear from us. Thank you.